Please, sir. Hi, uh, my name is Dr. Pramod Sadar Joshi. I'm the founder and CEO of Talent Smith Consulting, basically into startup architecture, startup advisory, change management, and digital transformation. I'm also a Marshall Goldsmith executive coach. Uh, there's a little bit about me, but what I really want to talk about is this platform, Jasba 1.0, amazing stuff, created by IIEC, right? It is the community of entrepreneurs and innovators, Indian Innovators and Entrepreneurs Community. The impetus and the ecosystem that they've created and are creating to give thrust to the entrepreneurial thinking for the startup culture is exactly what the doctor ordered, as they say. Here's the thing. India's economy, in terms of GDP, is a horrible $3 trillion economy, a two-point-something economy, $2.9 trillion economy, which constitutes 3% of global GDP contribution as compared to 14 to 16 percent of China and about 27 percent of USA. And what's our population? 1.3 billion. Guys, what's going on? 1.3 billion population and a meager 3 percent of global GDP. Others are having your lunch, dinner and breakfast. That is where the thrust for startup thinking, creativity, entrepreneurial mindset, uh, going out of the box, I think that's where this workshop by IEC, and I would really like to mention from the heart my gratitude to Mr. Vimal Daga and his wife Preeti Daga, the way they've curated this program, conceived it. Within 45 minutes, they've assembled a bunch of young engineers of the first and second year, and I've just seen about 20 stalls of startup ideas, mind-boggling, from ecosystem to grocery to solar system, any which space you take, architecture, innovation, home deco, any which segment you take, they've really come out with path-breaking ideas. I hope they get the funding, thanks to such workshops organized by Vimal Daga. I hope they get the motivation. And I am being an investor, and myself being one of the startup mentors, I'm very happy to coach and mentor, because that's my profession, all these young, budding youngsters to take India to the top, firstly, and secondly, to salute and respect the amazing efforts that these bright young engineers have put together. These people need that support, not just financial, but the thought leadership. And most important thing, this is an age where they're full of aspirations, but there are also a lot of challenges in the environment. My job and this event's job is to provide them the confidence and the courage and the compassion for them to go out there because the world is our oyster and you bet if such workshops are carried out throughout the country, the entire ecosystem of the country will grow such a big, it will indeed meet our Prime Minister's vision by 2023 to go to a $5 trillion economy globally. And one of the components of that is programs like this and such people. I wish this program very best. I'm extremely honored and privileged to be invited here to speak and to guide and to mentor and to look at investment of these funds. It's a phenomenal effort. I'm extremely, and frankly, I'm going back a more learned guy. Though they've called me as a coach, as an investor, the way I've learned from these young, digitally savvy guys, I think that's the future. As a famous saying goes, once reach should exit his grasp, or what's a heaven for? Ladies and gentlemen, I will just event Mr. Daga, Mrs. Daga, and the entire community here of innovators and entrepreneurs, the very best. And I'm sure with this combination of passion, humility and integrity will take to greater heights and as they say sky is the limit my best wishes and i'm most happy to contribute my two bits to make this program and this community and this program a grand success thank you god bless so we